Africa, a continent riddled with enigmatic beauty, a continent explored yet undiscovered. Morning dew under an African sunrise, one of the many things overlooked. Numerous insects and animals encountered along the way were enjoyed, yet taken for granted. These were things revealed when reflecting back on days accompanied by skinned knees and grubby clothes. After 14 years absence, and with a change of face, but not a change of heart, it was a return long time coming. Being fortunate to have lived a life most people can only dream about, my love for Africa was replenished by documentaries of places I long ago visited with my family. Africa's wildlife, large, small, and minute, are all fascinating to watch. Especially when looked at closely. Putting down the Big Five checklist for a moment does the world of good. I have seen remarkable things during my time in the wild. However, what I found most extraordinary was seen in a species many would call common. This particular species is the elephant. And for such a large mammal, you still need to look closely. The elephant's distinct features are its big flappy ears, wrinkly skin, large cushioned feet and a multi-purpose appendage called a trunk. These are all obvious characteristics, but try looking a little closer. It's more than skin deep. These were noticed in every elephant I came across. With a watchful eye over the young calves, mothers and aloe mothers keep them engulfed in a protective capsule of bodies as they make their way along well-worn paths. Daily rituals of rolling in the mud and dusting themselves off will never become obsolete, nor boring. The emotion and loving nature portrayed by this pair is one of the many I have encountered during my travels in Africa. One of the earliest examples of heartfelt emotion I had seen was captured by my father over a decade ago. A moment's silence along a dusty trail, both young and old, Pay their respects. This was a turning point for me. I realized that we favor ourselves as the superior species, when in reality, we are no better. In fact, I feel that we could learn something from these graceful creatures if we only took a moment to look closer. Can this be done? Can we look closely?
Ahnung. 